Hello and welcome to News Circle. Today we are going to look at the issues concerning sweatshops. And later on we are going to look and see how King Kong destroyed China. Over to you Libby Lou. Thank you very much Ria. Now I'm currently in a house in Bangladesh where children as young as five are being forced to work as sweatshop workers. Now follow me downstairs where these children are living in the basement and working there. Be careful, it's very dangerous down here. It's so cold and wet and damp, there's moss everywhere. It's actually disgusting. Now. This is the filthy and wet basement where many people are forced to work long hours with minimum pay. There are lots of rats and other creatures infesting this so-called work zone. <laughs> Hello, I finally reached the basement. It shows how far down these people are. Now we better be quick because, you know, their boss might come and capture me as well. So I don't want that. Excuse me, is it okay if we can have a moment of your time? Yes, please, uh, listen to me. I'm really sorry, okay. So hello, what's your name? Uh, my, my name is Lisa Roman. And how old are you? I'm 19 years old. And how long have you been working here for? Uh, um, uh, since I was six. Can you six. believe that? 13 years. That's two thirds of her life already. Now what's it like to live down here? It's horrible. There, there, are, there are very, very, very bad things here. And, and rats and, and... Poverty, poverty, okay? And how long do you work for? Like, give us give us an idea of your daily lifestyle. Yeah. Um, normally from very early in the morning to around 11, 12 at night. <gasps> uh, that's just slave abuse. I'm, I'm really I'm sorry, sorry about that. I hope your life changes. I think your boss is coming now. Okay, we, we better get going, okay? Because before, before they, you know, something happens, okay? Come on, let's go, go, go. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, no. Quick, quick, before something happens. Yes, it's a very sad matter. Thank you very much, Livy. Now, on to King Kong and how he destroyed China. But after the break, 